Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. I ordered a couple books on the internet. Check this out. They came to my mailbox from from Amazon.com. Packaged. Huh. Letter saying packaged by yours truly, Jeff. Jeff. Be Bezos. Be Bezos. 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 Yeah. Huh. Well, anyways, you can order books from the internet. <laughs> what is that? You know? Wow. I got the the Intelligent Investor by Benjamin Graham. Anyways, long story short, what we got going today is well, I guess there is a long story to this, but uh, I was uh, I was emailing I was I was emailing back and forth to Jake, the guy, the neighbor that lives over there last night. You know, I was I was up all night. We were emailing, we were talking, and we were talking about uh, maybe putting in a pond or trail between our properties here because we have timber between our properties. We want a nice pond to like play with, have fun with. You know, kids can swim in there, do stuff with, drown themselves, whatever they got to do. But then we were thinking, you know, it'd be kind of cool if we had that pond and then we had a trail through there. So uh, I think that's what we we're going to do. We decided last night, I was like, I sent the email, I was like, Let's do it. Today's the day. So uh, I'm going to head over to Jake's. He's supposedly got a dozer somewhere back in his woods that we're going to try to rip out and get to. Uh, but that's what we're doing. Now, since he has a dozer, we're going to fire up the old Screaming Eagle because we got the dozer's pretty slow, so we got to transport it across his property. So I was like, hey, I got a semi. We'll transport it. So the good old international 1989 Screaming Eagle. That's what we're going to haul her with. So I gotta move a couple, I gotta move this tractor up front so we can get the semi out, but well, let me tell you, this, this email thing is pretty darn cool. I was, uh, you know, I emailed Drake, or I emailed Jake, and then I was down, let's shift up a little bit, I was down at uh, the grocery store yesterday, and there's this, there's this nice girl, and so we started talking, and then, you know, I finally, I finally had the guts to say it, and I asked her for her email address. It was Sarah, Sarah J78. Oh, okay, I'm not gonna say the rest because I don't want you guys to take her, but at hotmail.com. And I was like, you know, and now we can talk, we can talk. But yeah, so now Sarah is like, all I gotta do, go to my computer in there, type something out, and then I can send her a message. Everybody's, everybody that watches this role play, I don't know where this role play goes because there's so, I think I said I had a wife, I have kids, I'm in high school. I don't know where this role play is going. So I apologize how confusing it is, but. We just like to role play 90s and I, but anyways, we're going down to Jake's. We're gonna go help him pull out a dozer, build a pond, build a, build a trail through there. I gotta say guys, if you end up enjoying this video, please help me out by just hitting the like button. It helps out the video so much uh, and it helps out me, it helps out the channel. I really, I really, really do appreciate you guys. Even, even if you don't hit the like button, I appreciate you guys for watching and I don't say that enough. Okay, keep backing up, keep backing up. There we go. Kingpin is in. She's hooked up. And so I think, I don't know how big the dozer is. I think we're going to try to put it on this trailer and then take it across the farm and start digging. Oh, I got to let one rip. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so here's, I can't even talk over this Jake break. Oh my gosh. Here's, uh, here's Jake's place. Looks like he's moving a disc. He's moving a tractor. Okay. Swing around somewhere. Is that an 84 r Or is that an 8300? That looks like a nice tractor through there, though. Come on. Come on. She's chugging. Jake, how you doing? Hey, boss. Not so bad. Yourself? Good, good. Nice, uh, nice international truck there. I appreciate it. Screaming when'd Eagle. You, yeah, when'd you pick that thing up? Uh, I think last year. Last year, last yeah. Last year. Last year, yeah. So. It sure is nice. About that email I, uh, sent to you last night. What are you thinking? Yeah. Do you think we can go get that dozer out today? I huh? think we can. Uh, I was out there yesterday, and uh, the fields aren't wet, so we should be able to get through no problem. Okay. Have you even taken a look at the dozer at even started that dozer? Not at all. Okay. No. <laughs> okay. I wonder if we can jump it with a semi. Jump start with a semi, and then... I don't have a winch, that's the only thing. So we gotta get started, then we get up on the trailer, at least. I don't have a winch either. I might have a chain out here somewhere, but okay. I'd have to look in the shop. Okay. Well, I'll pull over there. I'll, you lead the way, I'll follow you over there, and then we'll get going at this. All right, I suppose I'll just take my uh, my truck. I don't think I'll, I'll need anything else. So. Okay. 
Okay, I'll follow you over there. Alrighty. Jake, I'm, you on the CB there? I'm kind of... Yeah, I got you. Kind of backing through your yard. Am I good? You're good. Okay. It'll be fine. I know it's a little steep in parts here. Ooh, look at them skills. Look at <laughs> yeah, no, I, I played farm sim for five years. <laughs> oh, what's, what's this? Is this a... Uh, <laughs> oh, I guess... Them? I guess two, one year. Farm sim just came out. Farm Simulator 1998, I think, just came out. It's cool. Oh. My is son, it, uh, yeah. Is it any good? My, well, I mean, my son plays it, played it. I was like, what the heck? What, what, what? You can just do it out, outside, you know? And he's like, well, Dad, I, I love it, you know? So so uh, yeah. I hopped on, and then I got started getting addicted to it. But, yeah. He probably enjoys the fact that he can sit in the air conditioning and still farm. Yeah. Yeah, and and the wife just kicks him, cooks him as many cookies as he wants, so he gets food. He just gets to sit inside. That's the way to go. I yeah. wish that's how farming was for, for real. <laughs> yeah, I'll try to stay down these rows here so we don't. Oh, oh, there we go. We'll just take this water away. Yeah. Okay. It's a little softer here. A little bit. A little bit. Rained a few days ago, but it, it's mostly dried up. Okay. I get a little tight through here. So you, did you. you just buy this farm then? Yeah, I just bought all this land out here. Okay. And the dozer uh, came with it. Yeah, the dozer. I was just, uh, I was driving along the edge of the field and I saw the dozer sitting down here. <laughs> okay. But oh, to be my. honest with you, I've got more land than I need. So if you need to rent some, feel free. Uh, yeah, I would, uh, we'll have to talk about that. What are you thinking, boss? I think... I'm curious on why it's down here in the bottom of a ravine. <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> Against a tree. Maybe he's. Somebody. Maybe his wife just called and said it was dinner time. He just left it for 20 years. I don't. I don't know. Um, I'm gonna guess it doesn't start, but I can give her a go real quick. Yeah, try cranking her over. All right. Oh, you know what? This is uh, hold on. This has a uh, it has a pony motor. So it's oh, the okay. motors that it's a it's a little gas engine that fires up before. And then I think this is how it is. I've seen another guy had one. It fires up before, and then it warms the big motor up. I think, and I have no idea what motor's inside of here. I think that's how it works. Okay, try cranking it over. All right. That's the pony. That's the pony. That sounds like the pony going. Okay. Well, if that starts, then you just gotta get the big. Oh. Yeah, cause it's oh. Oh. Oh, I can't get the big one She's started, going. though. How's that work? It's going. It's good. You got it. I, I, I think we got it. <laughs> how long? Do you know how long this has been down here, Jake? Or I haven't got the slightest clue. <laughs> I didn't think it would start at all. Wait, wait. We should probably check the oil or something, dude. That, oh yeah. Okay, shut it off. Shut it off. Shut it off. Shut it off. Yeah. Also, we should check the fuel lines because uh, that fuel might have been a little. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let me check solid. dipstick oil. It looks looks good. What do you think? It it looks. I I mean I think that's good for now. Okay, yeah, it's it's on there. It's on the dipstick. That's good enough. Okay, I'll slide this back okay. in. Okay. Do you have a uh, oil filter wrench anywhere? I don't have one on me. Uh, I have one back at the shop. I don't have one in the semi though. Uh, okay. Well, I mean it it should be fine. It it's, didn't. It didn't die when we started it a second ago. So, it's got oil. It's got the hydraulic oil. It's got the shovel on the back still. I think we're. I think we're good. I think we should be good. Uh, all. Do you want me to? You just want to pull it up and then I'll get the semi down. Yeah, I'll see if we can. If it'll pull up this this slope. I think it or slope. I think it should. There's the pony. And there it goes. The big bad boy. <laughs> Horn even works. <laughs> Horn works. Uh, give me a second trying to figure out the uh, all the knobs in here to lift this stuff up. There you oh. go. Well, that works. Okay. Now I think it's foot control. Oh. Yep. Let's try turning up the hill here. There you go. Well, I better get this semi moved because Jake's coming up here. Okay. You it think it'll fit, little... Jake? I don't know. I can't see you past my blade. And okay, I'll, is hard to steer. I'll guide you. Come to All your right. left. To your left a little bit. Yep, yep. Keep coming. 
There you go. You're gonna fit. Yep, perfect. Keep coming straight up. Yep. Yep. Keep coming. We'll pull forward so those wheels slide back. There we go. Am I good to shut her down? You're good. All right. Man, that thing weighs a lot. Yeah, dude, that was uh, that was scary. I was heading up the the trailer, couldn't see anything in front of my blade, couldn't even see you at one <laughs> point. And you're like, I just hear you over the engine, keep going. I'm like, are you sure? <laughs> no, you're good. You're right on. I didn't know if you're gonna fit at first, but yeah, you fit good there. Anybody coming around the bend? We should be good, I think. I gotta swim wide through here. You can pass by me if you need to. Uh, that's all right. Okay. I think. I'll follow you behind. I want to make sure your trailer doesn't dip in. Everything good back there? Yep, we're okay. all good back here. Feel free to pull in and we'll unload it anywhere you we're want. Probably some level ground at best. Okay. We gotta make it up this hill. Come on. Screaming Eagle's struggling a bit. Nope, we're good. Oh, you got plenty of power. All right, so you're gonna see the uh, the you start the pony engine on the uh, kind of right side there. Okay. And then Got that. let that fire up your large engine. Okay. And then uh, to control the tracks, you have the uh, the center, the center uh, stick there. Okay? okay. Okay. And to control your other hydraulics and stuff, you have the additional ones on your side. Okay. I think you got it. And then back off. All good? Looking yeah, you're looking all right. You might want to bring right. the rear end to the left a little bit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't fall right. Okay, Don't okay, okay, that. okay. There you go. Straight back. You're good. So push that stick. Okay, okay, I got it. I got it. How's my alfalfa looking, by the way? <laughs> it's good, but not... doesn't look too good beyond the tracks. I'm sorry about that. That's all right. All right. It'll grow back. Okay, so your farm is right there, or yeah, at yep. those trees. My farm is right. Well, here, let's um, take a walk up here. I think it's right. <laughs> it should be up here. Should be a straight shot right across here. Right here at the bottom of the ravine is where our property lines change, yeah. I believe. Should My, be. Oh, it's, so the buildings are here to the right, just a wee bit. Okay. Right over oh, here. Oh, 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 okay. So if we made a trail that comes. Hmm. If we made a trail that starts right here. And then runs all the way down through here. Because you're built. Oh, you're building, sir. Yeah, this would be good right here. If we just cut through here. So we could take out. What about this? What? Hey, Jake, what about right here for a pool? Or for a pond? This seems. I think this will be a good spot. Okay. A couple trees to take out here yet. but Yeah. So we'll take out this build up tree. The dam on an, build up the dam on either side. And uh, I think this would work well. What I'm thinking is I could start a cut on these trees. Because these trees are just angled everywhere. I'll start a cut on the tree, and then you come in with the dozer and push it over so that we have force okay. and we know exactly what way it's going, if you're down for that. I'd, yeah, I think that's a good idea. Okay. You think you can take out this bad boy right here, and then... Ooh, that's, a, that's a big tree. <laughs> yeah, it is. Holy. Um, a lot of squirrels they, are going to be mad at us. but. Uh, I mean, in one go, it might be a little rough, but I think we can... I think we can get it. Okay, okay. Let's start with this one. I'll go grab the chainsaw. All right, I have one in the bed of my truck. Jake the bulldozer man. Here we go. Okay, you ready, Jake? Yeah, I think I'm... Should I be uh, higher up on this trunk, probably? Raise your blade all the way up. All right. There you go. Okay. Put pressure against it. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. There we go. Good. Okay, the tree is leaning on top of you. You're gonna have to really do some serious pushing here. Yeah. Maybe. Okay, let's go the other way. Let's go the other way. I'm an idiot. All right. We're kind of idiots. I'm an idiot. Yeah, that. Okay, here we go. This this is a lot smarter. Push, yep. push, push. Okay, there she go. Yep. Nice. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna push this tree out of here. If you need firewood, feel free to cut it up. Yeah. Let's see what that bad boy can do. We're about to find out. If I break a windshield, you're paying for it. 10 4. Oh, look at that go. Oh. My gosh. 
Holy cow. I didn't think it was going to push it at first, but I figured it out, revved it up a little bit. and. Yeah, no, that's good. Okay. Do we need any more through here? Uh, Depends how big of a pond we're making here. Well, Austin has a fairly big pond, and we got to at least make it bigger than Austin's pond. So. Okay. Well, I suppose we could... Uh... Are we building this this high side up as a, as the dam, or are we digging this in? What's the? We'll dig it in a little more. So we'll dig in this okay. area and then go around. So I'm thinking, uh, we could probably take out this tree. This tree for sure, I'd say. Okay, let me uh let me get the dozer here. Come. Hey, which side? Uh, what? Th this side. Come from this side. All right. Okay. Same thing. Just give her all she's got. All right. There you go. Keep pushing. There we go. Yep. Oh, I snapped it in half. <laughs> All right, pushing this one up. Yep, same thing. She's stuck on another tree. Just give her, though. All right, let's see if we can swing her off. Oh. There he goes. You stuck there, Jake? Need me to cut some of it? Oh. I think I got it. Oh, I had it. Hold on. Come on, baby. Oh, <laughs> look at him go. Oh, my gosh. I pushed it into another tree. That'll be good for now. There. That'll be good for now. It'll, it'll be fine. Well, we kind of need one of those stump grinders. We need to dig them out or something. I saw they make stump grinders for skid steers, and I got a skid steer, a little Johnny, that would just, he would absolutely love to partner up with a stump grinder, just take care of these stumps. I think it'd probably be smart for us to snag one of those real quick. Yeah. You and think, uh... Who, who'd have that? Is it Tractor Supply, John Deere, John, Class? Who's got one of those? I think John Deere might have one for rent. Well, Grant, I'd love to keep working on this today, but I've actually got to get into town and, and get some of my registration on some of the new equipment I, and insurance mm. all done. I had that set up for today, so. Yeah, that, that works. I gotta do some stuff, too. That'll work. Tomorrow? Keep working on her? Yeah. I okay. think we can come back out here tomorrow, and we could probably crank out most of the work we need to get done yeah that'll work good are you just gonna leave the dozer outside uh, i mean it's not like the paint's gonna rust anymore or anything <laughs> okay okay <laughs> i'm gonna right run back? back to my semi and then take the semi back and i'll see you tomorrow then yeah uh i'll i'll shut off the dozer and give you a ride back okay yeah that'll work good i'll jump in yep. thanks for the ride jake yep no problem have a good one you too well guys Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, we're back on the 90s. We're going strong. We're going to finish the pond out. Uh, next episode of the 90s. By the way, I got to say FSN. A lot of you guys were wondering about FSN. What's happening with FSN? FSN is uh, is done. It's just... I I thought I explained this, but maybe I didn't put in the video. But FSN is... Uh, it's really complicated to make videos on it because you can't just... You know, you got to earn the money. You can't just have $100,000 dollars in your bank and buy equipment to do role play so it's tough to make really entertaining content don't get me wrong i absolutely love fsn and if i didn't have to make content i would uh, i would i would play fsn all the time like it's the best but it's tough from a youtube approach to do it so hopefully you guys understand but anyways guys thanks for watching and hey seriously i really do appreciate you guys watching uh i really do and i don't say it enough so thank you guys and hey i'll see you guys later thanks guys